look at all this. Everything that I do, sheet over my black oak curtains that I'm going to return to Walmart and get something better like black oak sheets. I piled up all my boxes next to this one window. Just trying to block out the light. And this is the other side. <laughs> These are all my products. I use on my face and my mouth and what not. Finally got my chipped tooth from two months ago fixed and I did it at a holistic dentist. That took me forever to get there. It was in the boonies and I just almost didn't even make it there. The bus I took from around here. Google Maps said it would take me a very, not that long and they didn't account for traffic and what was supposed to take a little over a half hour took like an hour and then I wound up missing the train I had to take to this place hours and hours away because I said everything's hours away um, and then I arrived there and was told by the locals that they don't have taxi service there or you can call a taxi from another city but then you have to pay for that the taxi to come from that other city to there and, and, and I was already late for my appointments. I called them in tears and it was a holistic dentist I've never been to before and I was like, you know what, this wasn't meant to be and I'm sorry, you know, I was going to come in just to explain what had happened and I can't even take a taxi but I wasn't missing my train otherwise I could have, I would have been there an hour and 45 minutes early and I could have walked to the place. Well, what wasn't supposed to happen happened because this place is different and the reception they they came and got me it wasn't that far away and they dropped me back off at night it was interesting does it cost more than a regular dentist yes but not like double or something you know it's, it does cost more I don't care like to eventually get my four, I have four silver fillings from when I was a kid and they're leaking mercury 
into my mouth and into the mouth of anyone else who has them. Um, there are a lot of people who believe that if you ever read books and articles online, your mouth is killing you. That those silver fillings are just not good. Um, I would like to get them removed, but it's very expensive. I don't have the money, but I wanted to see where I stood. You know? I might be able to do it. I might, you know, you don't have to do it all at once. I don't know. But in any case, I wanted to see where I stood. You know, in case I want to do it in the future. yesterday. So I, I tried to call Cheryl when I was out and waiting in a train station and I couldn't reach her. I didn't try my mom. So I'm going to try her right now and see if I can reach her. I fasted all day Monday, yesterday morning, as I had predicted, I weighed 167, so, really need to nip that, no, on the bud, but, like I told my friend, the one who got me started and all this organic stuff, when I stayed with for those three months, my ex, my musician ex, um, While I've been here, I have for the most part been eating all non-GMO organic food and drink, drinking, you know, either spring water or organic milk, organic juice, and using all organic products for my teeth, my hair, and my face, just as I did those three months that I was with him, three plus months. But do cheat occasionally, and the times I've cheated have been when I'm out and about, particularly after I've gone and had a very, you know, draining, depressing visit with my mother in a mountain train station, or even around or whatever, waiting for buses and this, that, whatever, and, you know, Dunkin' Donuts. The other night, last week, I got a mint, small mint, mint, mint colada, mint chocolate colada, whatever it was, and it was absolutely delicious. Yesterday I had to wait an hour. Um, like I told him, I can uh, wait outside in the freezing cold, or I can buy something at a little place, whether it's McDonald's or whatever, and sit inside. This was a coffee shop type place, really, kind of like a restaurant type, Papagino's type place, not where they serve you or anything, so, um, um, and I bought, and I had to buy something, and I bought a mint, so I had over an hour to wait, and I was freezing out, once I got dropped off, back off by the dentist. And someone there had recommended an employee there and said, go, go there and you can wait inside. And they have free Wi-Fi and, you know, and they so they let people go there and, and sit there and lunch and buy something I bought. I didn't see coffee or anything listed. I don't drink coffee anyway, so I got a small chocolate moose tracks cone and it was absolutely delicious. But then when I finished it, I got caught. There was no one in the whole place. I, would, I had hid behind somewhere, but of course someone came to clean the table and they had to say something. I got caught very discreetly eating something from my bag. 
mean, so discreetly, it was like not even funny, nothing on the table, right? You think they, I mean, they had to say, you know, you're not allowed to bring an outside food. I'm like, no shit. I'm not allowed to. I was thinking to myself, yeah, I know. Obviously, I know that. I'm sneaking. That's why it's not on the table, and that's why I'm, I'm very discreetly taking it out of my bag and going like that, you know? But he happened to come at that exact moment, and I had to say something, even though there was nobody in the whole damn place, but... I didn't even say it. I go, okay. I didn't even say anything out loud. I just acknowledged that he had said it. It's not the crime of the century. Of course, it's not allowed any more than drinking out in public is allowed from containers that nobody knows his booze in, you know. It's little things, you know. I know it's not allowed. I did it anyway. And I got cut. Oh, no. I won't do it again. I might go there again. I would like to have not got caught. Caught and caught, but I got caught, so. I think I'll go try Cheryl. See if she heard any news. Because I'm going to ask, you know, can't Cheryl and my mom's social worker, even if they don't, even if the hospital staff does, this hospital doctor don't feel my mom's up to having a meeting, like they canceled last week's meeting. But so what? They can at least meet. I'm going to say, can't you guys just meet with the doctors and find out what's going on with my mom? If she won't have, she's not up to having a meeting, fine. She doesn't have to be involved. You guys can at least go. And that's what I think is going to happen, but. I need to find out. Can't wait till it's warm all the time. Freezing today, freezing yesterday. It's supposed to be spring. Yeah, sure. Try to get down to 150 pounds. I always say that and it never happens, but the miracle is when I stayed at Joe's, when I stayed at my friends, up at three plus months, I did at one point get down 153. That was amazing. Even though it's, it never amounts to anything, I'll try my mom too, just so I can, you know, 